सभी स्टूडेंट अपना कैमरा ऑन कीजिए गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल द गुड मॉर्निंग सर एंड द गुड मॉर्निंग सर या गुड मॉर्निंग सर एज यू आर ऑल अवेयर इग्नो रीजन सेंटर मुंबई इज ऑर्गेनाइजिंग हिज ऑनलाइन स्टूडेंट ग्रीवेंस रिड्रेस एंड ड्राइव इस शिक्षा की बात रीजनल डायरेक्टर के साथ प्रोग्राम फ्रॉम द लास्ट मार्च 2020 ऑनवर्ड्स आई होप ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स आर यूटिलाइजिंग दिस फैसिलिटी एवरी प्रीवियसली वी यूज्ड टू ऑर्गेनाइज एवरी वीक नाउ वी हैव मेड इट फोर्टनाइट that is a two weeks once further we are also going to take initiative the same student grievance redressal drive at the study centers at the study centers respect to study centers we are going to uh, upload the details every month one uh, day they will keep as a student grievance redressal drive day where some study centers are going to conduct the same activity through online some study centers are going to conduct through offline that means any student can visit the today uh, to the study center to clear their grievance in addition to regular opening because of you all know study center opens only 20 hours in a week it is a part time study center it is not full time where regional center opens monday to friday morning 9:30 to evening 6:30 you can visit the regional center is the permanent one whereas study center is a part time even that uh, the staff those who are working in the study center they are also part time functionaries they all work only 20 hours in a week not more than that as per the university uh, mou with that particular study center accordingly you can visit however we are going to take some more initiatives for the benefit of the students and for providing better student support services let me give you some of the important information before we take individual queries uh, regarding the admission we have completed the fresh admission now this july session ke liye july 2022 session re registration has started re registration means registration for your second year as well as the anyone second semester third semester fourth semester like that suppose the student those who have joined yearly program in july 2021 like ba bcom bsc ma mcom msc these are yearly programs if anyone join in the july 2021 and before not done the second year registration they have to do it this is through online mode the link has already uploaded in our igno website you can visit last date is 30 june 2022 that is regarding the re registration those who have joined semester based programs like mba mca bca pcdis pcdca in january 2022 session they have to do re registration for their second semester or even third semester like that they have to do it for that also last date is 30 june 2022 please make use of this facility or 
if it is not relevant to you or even you can pass this information to your friends those who need this information that is regarding the re-registration and you know uh, this july 2022 fresh admission will start very soon uh, and we will give the notification that is uh, another issue coming to this june 2022 examination where you have to do the certain activities already registered students eligible students to write their examination in the june 2022 for that you have to submit your assignments you all might be knowing the last date for submission of the assignment is 31st may 2022 we have already updated all the study center details we already informed to the student to send it by post or directly you can go to the study center and submit your assignments the study center working hours emails phone numbers has been updated and some of the students are referring the old data and even still 1601 that is the kj somaya college that study center we have shifted that study center from kj somaya college of education to kj somaya college of arts and commerce and the email also different email but still the students are sending the email to the old email id please refer to our rc mumbai website for getting the updated email of all the study centers and you know within two days time may we are going to add some more columns in that study center details were related to the assignments ke liye kisko contact karna hai related to the other student grievances ke liye kisko contact karna hai their timings and other issues also we are going to uh, add very 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 soon maybe uh, within 2 uh, 3 days time mein it will but for submission of your assignment either you can go directly to the study center or send it by post suppose if any student is going to the sathe college for submission of assignment on sundays you go between 10 to 12 only the study center opens 10 to 12 even kj somaya college also sundays they open 10 to 12 that we have changed suppose anyone is referring the old because of they have given a old 4 to 7 evening sathe college in the recent meeting they told sir that it has to be changed to the 10 to 12 morning accordingly anyone is going to sathe college or kj somaya college because of major proportion of the students maybe suppose some psychology students anyone is going to the seva sadan or the hansaraj jeevandas college you have to go accordingly as per their timings because of this bed college ke holidays hai they they told to their security people to receive what i suggest instead of going to the study centers you please send it by post indian post speed post you can send keep the postal slip as a proof of your assignment submission someone is writing sir uh, it has to be posted on 31st or it has to be reached to the study center by 31st one or two days there is no problem last date is 31st may 2022 if you are submitting directly at the study center you have to submit on 31st if you are sending by post one or two days delay ho gaya to bhi they will accept there is no problem accordingly you can plan and submit assignments assignment ke liye you are all knowing the first page should have the details of your enrollment number your program code your course code your study center code and your address including your email id and phone number that should have the first page 
there is no separate format like that please don't ask any question what format we have to follow there is no particular format but the first page should have your details compulsory your enrollment number your program code whatever the course assignments you are submitting that course code your study center code suppose some of the students are submitting maybe some students ke liye study center is given 49 that is the rc mumbai uh, i am i am speaking about the uh, foreign language student course ke liye spanish language japanese korean language german language that students you can submit at the regional center mumbai in our office all other students you have to submit the assignments at your study center only because of some of the students are sending it by post to the regional center address we are not at all accepting it we are sending it back to the student because of that is your responsibility some students simply sending the email attaching the assignments they are thinking it will be updated no so we told very clearly you have to submit it at the study center accordingly you have to plan you have to submit your assignments and suppose if you are sending it by post keep the postal slip with you as a proof if you are submitting at the study center take the receipt acknowledgement copy that means take the signature of particular received person on your first page as well as stamp of the study center future may any problem aaya to you can show it as a proof that's what i am telling very 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 important you have to keep either your postal slip with you or acknowledgement copy of your assignment submission that is related to your june 2022 december 2021 ke liye some of the students are sending the uh, emails sir i have submitted my assignments in the month of the september october november abhi tak mera update nahi ho gaya it is under evaluation almost all we have completed some 70% of the assignment evaluation remaining 30% is there most probably in the third week of the june maximum end of the june all the assignments of the december 2021 will be updated in your grade card maybe some of the students are having the questions i have submitted eight assignments isme four update ho gaya four ka abhi tak status nahi hai yes it will all will be updated because of four they have sent the award list to the regional center i am i am also informing you the process of the assignment evaluation and the updation i will inform you you are submitting assignments at the study center the study center up to the last date they will keep all the assignments after that they will segregate it to course wise and they will send that course wise assignments to the academic counselors or the experts they will correct they will send the award list to the study center after that study center will enter in the online portal after that hard copy they will send to the regional center we will cross verify award list hard copy with the online data then we will give the authentication this data will go to the delhi again they will verify after that they will upload in your grade card these many checks are there these many points where we have to spend the time that's why it is taking time you please understand by maximum end of the next month all the december 2021 assignments awards will be updated in your grade card that is related to the assignments coming to the examination 
June 2022. Uh, I hope all you all uh, seen the date sheet, which has been already uploaded in our IGNO main website. June 2022 ke liye exam timetable already uploaded. It is going to start from 22 of the July. July 22nd, that is a Friday onwards. It is going up to the September 4th, it is going on that examination. That's why that is a, they have mentioned it is a tentative date sheet. They will finalize maybe one or two slight changes. Maximum, that will be the final. Accordingly, you can plan. Maybe students are sending the email. Examination form not yet opened. When it will be opened? It will be opened very shortly. Because of now, we are updating the information related to the exam centers all the 56 regional centers they have to send the details to the delhi then they will update the website this online portal it may take some time one week one week or 10 days time come there they will open the online examination form entry accordingly you can select your exam center please wait one week it will be updated in our Igno main website, igno.ac.in. I hope everyone have joined in our social media, uh, particularly Mitra is the Mumbai Igno telegram room for assistance. That is very uh, student friendly as well as the easy one to communicate to the student. Uh, because of uh, even emails ka upar, uh, if anyone not joined in our telegram room, please open our RC Mumbai website. In the home page itself, the icon is there. Mumbai Igno telegram room for assistance. There is a Mitra. You click join all the information, even this date sheet, exam form, opening date, and the assignments project, practical, and everything, we are updating it. Please make use of the facility. And follow our Facebook, Twitter, and regularly check our IGNO website and RC Mumbai website. This is a, a information we are going to post related to the examination. Exam ke liye, already timetable uploaded in the website. Exam form is going to be opened within one week or 10 days time because of your examination is going to start from the july 22nd you have a lot of time to fill the exam form uh, uh, maybe uh, june first week it will open probably that is related to the your examination now you, you for the june 2022 exam KLA, the students those who are doing the two activities one is synopsis submission if anyone is having the project final project submission internship submission and the field work journal submission i will come to the first final project submission june 2022 those who are eligible that means already if your synopsis approved last session may you have to submit your final project by 31st may 2022 it is through online mode online project internship field work journal submission link already opened it is available in our igno main website igno.ac.in it is available 
even last week we have organized one special session on particularly this project internship and field work there was a good number of students have attended more than the 108 students attended we have given the guidelines now also i am telling you please submit your final project yes i agree some of the students raised the point as the link is not working properly no need to worry no need to worry we have already informed to the delhi they are rectifying it okay if the 31st go it is not possible means not rectified they will give you the time no need to worry no need to worry you try still 31st go link not working you are having any technical problem any other issues definitely university will extend the date no need to worry otherwise regional center will take care about your submission okay no need to worry much about that one that is your final project internship even msw students your field work journal also should be submitted through online mode you can scan that field work journal you can upload even bta students any bachelor degree student having the project and dece students dnhe students even msc dfsm students pzdis students MCA, BCA, all the students, those who are having the component of the project, component of the internship, component of the field work journal, you all can submit through online link, which is available in our IGNO main website. That is related to the your final project. Now I am coming to the synopsis synopsis is the for the, your project those who have taken second year admission second year admission in january 2022 session those who have taken the january 2022 session second year admission before january 2022 and before sessions not submitted their synopsis for you we have given the online submission link it is available in our rc mumbai website and i'm specifically informing you all final project submission link is in our main website igno.ac.in your synopsis submission link in rc mumbai website why i am specifically informing you all previous time also some of the students wrongly submitted their synopsis in the main final project submission link main. that was rejected their last six months time that's why I am uh, once again informing you all if you want to submit your synopsis you have to visit our RC Mumbai website their online link is there you can submit if you want to submit your final project field work journal or internship report final reports in our IGNO main website accordingly you can submit here in the synopsis the programs who has to submit the programs list i am informing you very clearly synopsis should be submitted at the regional center that is a bca mca pzd fsqm ma psychology ma education 
PZDEMA. These are the programs. They have to submit their synopsis at the regional center. PZDFSQM, one, and, uh, one uh, student has uh, typed, is asking synopsis. Ka. Uh, this synopsis submission, because of it is a one year program, PZ diploma. Suppose even PZDEMA, PZ diploma in educational management and administration, even MA psychology. This is all yearly programs. If you have submitted your synopsis, this synopsis result will be declared in the month of soon last week or July first week. You all have to wait, those who have submitted their synopsis, because of your final project report submission in November 2022 not before that some of the students are thinking now i will submit synopsis 31st may is the last date immediately i will do that one project i will upload like that no either it is a pzdfsqm pzdema or ma psychology ma education all this your synopsis submission those who have taken that mission, I am telling, January 2022. Synopsis submission last date is 31st May 2022. And your result also will be declared only after the last date of final project submission for this June 2022. Before that, it will not be declared. That's why I told tentatively last week of the June are first week of the July 2022. I wrongly admitted one student now. I am telling very seriously, we are giving the admission 11 a.m. to 11.20. After that, we are not admitting any student because of you have to follow and someone is joining at 12.30 or 1, 1 o'clock and they are taking up to the three o'clock no there should be some discipline accordingly we are making it related to this synopsis as i told 31st may 2022 after that we are not going to extend any date please don't ask any question about the extension of the date please follow the dates as per the schedule synopsis scale 31st night midnight it is going to be closed that link and other issues related to your field work suppose some of the msw students the list of the field work approved academic counselors as uploaded in our website you can approach them suppose it is related to all the programs Either it is the uh, MCA, BCA, MA Psychology, uh, MSW, MA Education, uh, MSc Environment, MSc DFSM. Those who are having the component of the project field work internship, the list of approved academic counselors as well as the guides. All approved academic counselors are eligible to complete the project, internship, and the field work. At least we have uploaded in our website. It is a open distance learning, and also the faculty. There are part-time functionaries. They are not from the IGNO. They are from the different colleges. They voluntarily came we will act as a academic counselor of the IPNO. We cannot force them and even we cannot dictate them. They, they are the part-time functionaries and we have uploaded the list. Student can directly approach them, get their consent 
start your synopsis or start your field work or start your internship now coming to the project project ke liye first you have to prepare your synopsis synopsis should be approved by your project guide without consent of the project guide no synopsis will be accepted their signature on your synopsis is compulsory i told very clearly the programs which have to submit the synopsis at the regional center already i have uh, told two three times they all have to prepare their synopsis synopsis should be approved by your project guide their signature is compulsory without their signature no synopsis will be accepted some of the students are writing why i am stressing that particular point some of the students are writing sir i don't want any guide i can do myself no synopsis should be prepared by the student and approved by the your guide that is one issue related to the synopsis and the final project even your final project also should be approved by your guide your while you are uploading in the online portal along with your final project you should attach the certificate of originality that is a very very important one where student as well as the guide will sign on that one and your synopsis approval copy some of the students are telling sir we have seen our name in the list there is no separate mail or separate letter we have not received yes that list where your name appears attach that list highlight your name and along with that your approved synopsis also should be attached synopsis approval copy as well as approved synopsis because of for the ma psychology program synopsis is having the 10 marks if you are not attaching that synopsis we will give you zero mark that's why you should compulsorily attach your certificate of originality your synopsis approval copy that is the list where your name should be highlighted third one is approved synopsis this three along with your final project you have to upload in the portal then it will be accepted otherwise last time we have prepared the discrepancy this time we are not going to prepare the discrepancy because of our honorable vice chancellor want to declare means he is very much uh, concerned about the students now for the june 2022 projects whatever the students have submitted already we have received though the last date is 31st may 2022 now we have received some 40 50 projects we are processing it because we want to conduct the viva wise maybe now the dates are very clear it is the july maybe before the examination also we will conduct the project internship viva wise there is a chances there is a chances because of we have uh, received the first lot maybe within uh, one week time may we will process it and we will send to the external examiners if the external examiners give their comments maybe before the examination june month is there full june month maybe in the june no, third week or uh, last week may we will conduct the viva wise of the first lot maybe in the july may second lot we will com complete if the date not extended we will complete it 
that is related to the project internship okay next coming to the practical maybe so many students are waiting for the practical also practicals uh, we have not yet finalized the dates we are going to conduct the sessions next month next month we are waiting for the guidelines if they say you can conduct through online it will be conducted online or if they say offline now the situation became normal you can conduct offline accordingly schedule will be informed to the students no need to worry uh, maybe I, I am seeing some of the psychology student faces uh, maybe they may be worrying about uh, uh, Seva Southern College, Hansara, Jeevandas College accordingly we will organize if it is offline I thought uh, we will make the package Seva Southern Mesam and Hansara, Jeevandas College Mesam we will organize we will uh, take care about the students comfortability also there is no need to worry about that one but so far we have not till date we have not finalized the sessions for the practicals but anyhow next month we are going to conduct your sessions maximum we will conduct through the uh, google meet uh, or the facebook live sessions already conducted sessions practical sessions available in our facebook page i hope everyone already joined psychology students all are following our facebook page this already recorded videos or uh, mpcl 007 or uh, mpc 14 24 34 recorded videos are available you can go through that next month we are going to conduct the your sessions uh, maximum through online you, you will receive the information very very shortly you please concentrate on the remaining activities these are the uh, important uh, issues or the information i would like to share uh, with the students what about pzdma already i told pzdma those who have taken the admission in the january 2022 you have to submit your synopsis by 31st may 2022 through online link it is already available in our rc mumbai website you please follow that please read the program guide accordingly you can prepare your synopsis and submit it this is related to all the students even suppose your practicals conducted you have attended the practicals no need to attend again as I told even previous times also, suppose if you have attended through online mode, Facebook Live, you have to take the screenshot of that particular session. Keep with you 100% attendance is compulsory. Okay? That prepare your journal. Wait for the link. We, we have first, first step, we are going to conduct the practical sessions for MA psychology first year and second year sessions, second year students in the month of June. After successful completion of the practical sessions, we will give, RC Mumbai only will give you the link, online link for submission of your practical journal. At that time, you can upload the journal. after that we will conduct after that we will conduct the viva wise that's why i i am i'm just related to the practical why i am not giving much clarity or much information we are waiting for the guidelines whether the practicals to be conducted through online or offline suppose if it is conducted through online there is a different procedure if it is conducted through offline, there is a different procedure. That's why uh, I'm, I'm just I'm telling we will conduct the sessions in the month of June. Once the sessions are completed, we will give you online link for submission of your journal. Once you submit your journal, your examination will be conducted either before your term and examination 
or after the term and examination. Because it is not only the meeting, we are interacting. We are going to organize so many meetings. There is no problem. Maybe next uh, meeting, I will give you the more clarity. That's why now concentrate. Suppose anyone has already completed their practicals, ready with the, your journal, please keep with you. We will give you the proper information. Accordingly, you can submit. Th this information, now I am stopping here. Uh, we are going to take individual queries. No need to worry. What, what I, my request is, uh, PCD, MA, KLA, already we have connected the classes. We have connected the classes. Again, we are going to connect uh, after this uh, summer vacations in the month of the August because of your examination uh, in the month of the December. That's why we are going to do it. Uh, about the BSc G practicals, already we are conducting first year. First year practicals we are conducting from the May 1st onwards. It is going to complete by the 26th June. June third. Suppose anyone missed, we all have to wait for the second session, which we are going to conduct in the Diwali holidays time. Old BSc students, KLA, we have completed the practical examination in this month, 18, 19, 20. We extensively given this information in our website, our social media, I personally posting in the Facebook, Twitter and the Telegram channel because of I know the pain of the students. That's why personally I am monitoring every activity related to the students, particularly even this BACG practical KLA, we have uh, informed to the all the students. All the students are eligible. Suppose if you have not received the information, now also you want to join. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., you go to the Satya College and meet the coordinator. They will admit you for the next practical scale. Suppose any student missed the practical, you all have to wait for the Diwali holidays. At the time, we are going to conduct second year and the third year that practicals about MA psychology practicals I told um, now uh, we are going to take individual queries my request is please don't repeat the the same question already I gave maximum clarity related to all the uh, issues and uh, now uh, one of our student is writing about the MSc environment science Yes, we, we have planned practicals for the MSc Environment Science. Some of the practicals we are going to conduct through online. Actually, the KJ Somaya College has submitted the schedule. There is a, some uh, administrative errors in that schedule. We ask the KJ Somaya to rectify and send it. Maybe within one week time, we will upload the practical schedule of the MSc environment science, all the courses, whatever the students are eligible and it going to be conducted through online as well as the offline. Maybe some of the students are out of the Mumbai, they may because of someone from the other state also join, but offline practicals also you have to attend. That is a compulsory one. There is no uh, exemption for that. 70% we are going to conduct through on online mode. Remaining 30% we are going to conduct through offline mode. You all please uh, prepare mentally to come to the Mumbai and attend at the KJ Somaya College. Suppose if you are unable to attend now, you can uh, attend the next session. There is no problem. Everyone knows there is a minimum period and the maximum period. Even for the master degree program, we are having the two years minimum period. Maximum period is the four years. Within this four years time, you can complete your program. There is no issue. Either it is a MSc Environment Science or a MA Economics or a MA Psychology, whatever it may be the master degree program, you are having the two years minimum duration. 
maximum four years duration. Within that period, you can complete all your theory, assignments, your project, practical, whatever the compulsory components. And finally, I am uh, informing to all the students, please visit our website regularly. You have to refer only two websites. One is the national website, our main website, igno.ac.in, related to all the activities. Second one is your regional center website. That means rcmumbai.igno.ac.in. I hope all the students are from the RC Mumbai. Maybe sometimes other regional center students are also joining. We are not saying no to any student because of it is an IGNO uh, program. Anyone can join. This information is to all the IGNO students. Okay. But RC Mumbai students have to refer rcmumbai.igno.ac.in. That is the website. Why I am putting the stress on this particularly RC Mumbai website? Someone is referring to the Delhi uh, 1, Delhi 2, Delhi 3. They are bringing to uh, our notice are that the regional center is telling like this. No. You please follow the dates, the links, whatever is given by the RC Mumbai. And you will get all the support. You have to visit our website regularly. Second one, follow our Facebook page, Twitter handle and join this Mitra. That is a telegram room. In addition to that, you all know, if you are having any queries, you can directly interact with me through this online student grievance redressal drive. In addition to this, we are also we are going to organize exclusively one day student grievance redressal drive in your respective study center through online or offline mode. That details also we are going to upload. Please make use of this facility. Don't take any tension. IGNO is a national open university. It is a public university. It is directly under the Ministry of Education, Government of India. We are all here to support you. We are all here to serve you. We are all here to provide you better student support services. I wish you all the best for your assignment submission, your final project submission, your synopsis submission and even for your examination uh, of the June 2022. Uh, uh, now uh, we request the students, uh, you can raise the hand still if you are having any doubts. Uh, individual doubts. As I told very clearly, assignment related, December 2021 assignments, awards will be updated by next month, third week maximum. Okay, no need to ask again the question. Sir, I have submitted eight assignments. Is my four update ho gaya. Remaining four update nine ho gaya. I told that's one. Please, because of we have to. Time is very precious to everyone uh, and uh, the students, those who are not having any doubts, they can leave the uh, meeting. Uh, this recorded uh, version also, this recorded video also, we are uploading in our RC Mumbai YouTube channel. Uh, any student miss this information, they can uh, visit our YouTube channel later also they can uh, get the information. Thank you. Thank you one and all. Now one of our staff will call one by one those who raised the hand and accordingly we will take the queries. No need to worry. I will be here. I will attend all the student queries. No need to worry. Please follow the sequence whatever our staff is calling. Okay. Thank you.